I'm Laura Harper Lake. And I'm Sarah Reitzman. And, and we, we are Creative, Creative Guts. Guts. So Creative Guts started as a podcast where we interview creatives of all different disciplines to give them an opportunity to put themselves out there and to inspire others. Later on, it formed into a nonprofit where we do a lot of creative-based programming for creatives and for people who do not identify as creatives yet. So the podcast is for everybody. We want to give creatives a platform so that they can share their stories with the world, but we want the world to feel inspired to then go out and do their own creative practice. So it's artists, writers, dancers, chefs, videographers, the gambit. Uh, and we really want to make sure that people have an opportunity to get out there even more. And we really want everyone just to feel like it's something that everyone has, they can achieve it. And there's this really beautiful thing that happens and we've noticed it in interviews and folks who listen to every interview might notice that there's these sort of reoccurring themes that no matter how sort of amazing or celebrity the, the creatives are that we're interviewing that we all sort of experience the same things like imposter syndrome comes up in almost every single mm -hmm. interview. And so truly it's like this way for us all to connect with each other through these shared stories. Creative Guts has provided the opportunity to network with so many other artists and individuals in our community. And I'm an art teacher by day and an artist by night. And so to be able to be able to reach out to some of these artists who are on the podcast and say, hey, would you be interested in showing your work at our school or painting a mural on our walls or speaking with our students? It's, it's just so inviting and it just opens up this incredible network for, for, for shared joy and love of the arts and our world needs more of that. For someone who's up and coming to hear other artists talk about their experience and their process, it's invaluable. Because we're all creative deep down. I think at the heart of it, it's an open opportunity for people to find encouragement to express themselves. A part of Creative Guts' mission is to try to be as accessible as possible with what we provide. So along with the podcast, we produce a lot of zines where creatives can submit their work. So putting the spotlight on the folks that are making this place even more special to be in, the state of New Hampshire, it's really, it's really amazing. Yeah. We know that creativity and art is important to the economy, to the vibrancy of our community. So it's a big deal to recognize the people who are doing that work. It's really nice to bring people together, Yeah, Laura. yeah. <laughs> That's the, what gives us life and what keeps us going.